Assalamualaikum dan salam sejahtera kepada semua yang hadir pada pagi ini. Semoga kita mendapat manfaat daripada apa yang kita lalui pada forum ini. Welcome to today's forum. I think the economy and um, the growing Malaysia's uh, economic prosperity uh, under the new federal government. And uh, this new federal government that I'm referring to is actually uh, and come under Pakatan Bayang. I uh, assure you that this is a real, very real possibility. And seeing the, <laughs> and seeing your response, uh, which is overwhelming, I am very much reassured myself that this can be the future of our country. As such, then, one must make the necessary preparations. In the last five years, for the first time in the Indonesian history, Pakatan Rakyat has been ruling four state governments, as you know, in Kalimantan, <coughs> Kedah, Aikwa Bonamista, Penang, and Selangor. While some new governments may have the privilege of time to their jobs, Pakatan Rakyat state governments and had to hit the ground running. In just one term, Pakata Rakyat state governments have actually improved the financial standings of their respective states. We have reduced that. We have charted impressive investment growth and we have improved state reserves. We achieved good economic growth and at the same time, we also focused on redistributing wealth to the right. We gave free water to the poor. We allocated 1,000 ringgit grants to first year students for higher education. We provided microcredit to encourage small startups and grassroots entrepreneurship. We put a stop to the practice of closed tenders and negotiated tenders. Instead, we practice open tenders in the Pakatanaya states. This transparency has resulted in savings of 30%. We focused <coughs> on reforming the state administration. We formulated public policy that serves both the interests of investors and also the interests of the right hand towards a fairer deal for all. Most importantly, we have been successful in assuring the business community that we can form stable state governments. Stable state governments, which are based on, on the fundamentals of good governance and accountability. Good governance and accountability is good for business and good for the right life. All these reforms are necessary, more so today, when we are posed with this critical question, what will Pakatan Rakyat do when we take over Putrajaya? I will still want to be too blatant. I will still want to be to gamble about it, but you can't actually blame me. It's been a long time since Malaysia has had our independence. I was one of those born at that time. And we have never learned, we have never known any other government. Now, we there were instances and we tried to change. We all know that there must be some change, but we never had the chance and the air, or the feeling in the air that it is possible. It is possible. It took a man's sacrifice, a man who had to go to jail, a man, I mean, a family. But that is actually nothing for the future of our country. So despite the short period of time at state governments, in spite of the constant sabotage, intimidation, harassment by the PM, 
I know you go through. Today, as former leader of the opposition, don't forget, I was once the former leader of the opposition uh, in 2008 for a few months. I'm proud to stand here and say to all Pakatan Rakyat governments, state governments, Tahna, congratulations. However, we cannot and must not rest on our laurels. Let us remind ourselves that we must do better. We can do better, inshallah. We have been busy in the past five years making sure our state governments are in order and making sure that we are clean and corrupt free. We have also been busy preparing, planning economic, economic policies for the future federal government. These policies are contained in our Pakata Rakyat Manifesto launched a few weeks ago. Our policies are also contained in the Common Policy Platform and the Kujinga. Jinga is orange, our orange book. The forum today is in two parts. The first part is to showcase to you what we have done in the state government, at the state government level, and how we intend to introduce these good governance practices to Putrajaya. I welcome Dr. Lisa Jamaluddin with Chen Chong. The second part of this forum is to introduce to you the economic policies that we have been formulating for the past five years. Pakata Raya can achieve our economic vision for a better Malaysia with your support. With your support. As such, your feedback in today's forum is essential. What we tell and what you tell the business community after the forum is also very important. So please, support us in our journey to make Malaysia great and vibrant again. Support us to bring back prosperity to our beloved country. This is our country, all of us. We are born of a different race, but that's not of our choice. We are here in Malaysia. We are Malaysians together with the world because the world has become small. Together we have to build our country, our beloved, beloved nation. So I ask of you, I seek your help and support. Not only because we went through terrible times, but we see a new vision, a new future for our country. Come with us all together to for our country. I also lastly have to uh, like to extend a special thank you to Sunmax Media and Supermax Corporation for sponsoring this forum. <laughs> thank you, that was for your lunch and your food. A big thank you to all for making this happen. And I wish you a fruitful forum. Thank you.